Welcome back. Today's topic is Introduction to Areas to History. Let us begin by understanding what environment is. Environment is the surrounding in which we live. It includes all those things on which we are directly or indirectly dependent for our survival. Whether it is living components like plants and animals or non-living components like air, water and soil. So what does environmental studies mean? Environmental studies is a multidisciplinary academic field which systematically studies human interaction with the environment. Thus, in EVS2, that is Environmental Studies Part 2, we would be learning about how we came to be. Here is a fast forward display of the major subject matter that we would be studying this year. We shall now focus our attention to what is history. Imagine that you wake up one morning and you're not able to remember who you are or what happened in your life yesterday. You are unable to recognize anyone and can no longer understand what they are saying. You don't remember what the words books, movies, school, friends, family, teachers or memories mean. Without historical knowledge, we miss a great source of enjoyment that comes from piecing together the story of the past, be it our own, our nations or the world's. If we want to know how and why our world is the way it is today, we have to look to history for answers. People often say that history repeats itself. But if we study the successes and failures of the past, we may ideally be able to learn from our mistakes and avoid repeating them in the future. Studying history is important because it allows us to understand our past which in turn allows us to understand our present. It also helps us to learn from our mistakes 
and avoid repeating them in the future. Let us have a quick look at a few essential terms in history. Chronology or chronological order. It is an arrangement of events in order of occurrence or time. Example, 1990, my birth year. 1994, went to school. 2006, passed out school and so on. Timeline It is a graphical representation of time on which important events are marked. Example Archaeology it is the study of things that people made or used and left behind. Archaeologists They are scientists who study archaeology. Historians They are scholars or writers of history. That's it from me, your teacher, Ashnima. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos.